Finger Detroit. It's, um, we've been in operation since 2015, creating from a design to a production all in Detroit. Uh, and we use leather that's actually reclaimed from the Detroit auto industry. So what was going in the brand new car seats and steering wheels, we take that leftover scrap, quote unquote scrap, and we turn that waste into something wonderful, right? So we think that uh, things that are such high quality that are meant to last a lifetime shouldn't be shipped overseas or landfill, right? And so we create products that get more character as they go, right? Character and purpose with everything we do, just just like the people who make it. We are a company of civilians and veterans coming together to really create neighborhood resiliency. So we see an opportunity to really come together, to collaborate, to create things that haven't been done before, like the first sneakers ever made in Detroit. We're making them right here in Detroit, at Pingree Detroit, and really what we're out to do is create work that inspires, both inspires our workers to make it, and inspires our customers who are a part of our story, who are alongside us in our mission, and who really embody this commitment to be a part of Detroit's comeback. The comeback story needs to also involve the neighborhoods. And so we're embedded right in a neighborhood, in a community. We see the importance of making work that's accessible to the neighbors. That no matter where you're at, you can get trained up and skilled into using a skilled trait to be a part of that creation, that comeback, that, that solution. So we want to create products and, and systems that are solutions. And so with the folks on our team, um, everyone is learning a skilled trade and they are part of that literal solution of we're making living wage jobs that solve a problem of waste, solve a problem of unemployment, solve a problem of a lack of sustainability, and really create this all within the confines of what's called worker ownership. Everything that we do uh, is within this container of worker ownership, which means that everyone's on a direct pathway to co-own the company with us uh, after one year. So you can have literal and figurative ownership at every level of our process so that when the company is doing well and you're seeing ways to improve a process, we all do better and we contribute more and we're more involved and, and we're a literal and figurative owner of everything. Ownership is real big and, and being able to eventually be part of a company and be ownership in that company, man, that's, that's huge. Making things in the, in the country is, is one thing because we haven't made anything in this country so long. China is, you know, making everything. And if we can get back to handmade something, <laughs> or just making something factured, manufactured here in the city, that's that's huge. Now we can, you know, export a lot of, you know, a lot of items. So it's it's huge for making things in the city that people can represent and wear around the wear around the country, around the world.